It is estimated that 1 in 110 children in the United States have an autism spectrum disorder. Studies in Asia, Europe and North America have identified individuals with an autism spectrum disorder with an approximate prevalence of 1%. Autism spectrum disorders are reported to occur in all racial, ethnic, and socioeconomic groups, yet are on average four to five times more likely to occur in boys than in girls. If 4 million children are born in the United States every year, approximately 36,500 children will eventually be diagnosed with an autism spectrum disorder. Assuming the prevalence rate has been constant over the past two decades, we can estimate that about 730,000 individuals between the ages of 0 to 21 have an autism spectrum disorder. Approximately 13% of children have a developmental disability, ranging from mild disabilities such as speech and language impairments to serious developmental disabilities, such as intellectual disabilities, cerebral palsy, and autism. Studies have shown that among identical twins, if one child has an autism spectrum disorder, then the other will be affected about 60 to 96 percent of the time. In non-identical twins, if one child has an autism spectrum disorder, then the other is affected about 0 to 24 percent of the time. Parents who have a child with an autism spectrum disorder have a 2 percent to 8 percent chance of having a second child who is also affected. It is estimated that about 10% of children with an autism spectrum disorder have an identifiable genetic, neurologic or metabolic disorder, such as Fragile X or Down syndrome. As we learn more about genetics, the number of children with an autism spectrum disorder and an identifiable genetic condition will likely increase. Studies show that 5% of people with an autism spectrum disorder are affected by Fragile X and 10% to 15% of those with Fragile X show autistic traits. 1 to 4% of people with autism spectrum disorder also have tuberosclerosis. About 40% of children with an autism spectrum disorder do not talk at all. Another 25% to 30% of children with autism have some words at 12 to 18 months of age and then lose them. Others may speak, but not until later in childhood. The average age of earliest autism spectrum disorder diagnosis is between 4.5 and 5.5 years, but for 51 to 91 percent of children with an autism spectrum disorder, developmental concerns had been recorded before three years of age. Studies have shown that about one-third of parents of children with an autism spectrum disorder noticed a problem before their child's first birthday, and 80 percent saw problems by 24 months. Research has shown that a diagnosis of autism at age 2 can be reliable, valid, and stable, but despite evidence that autism spectrum disorders can often be identified at around 18 months, many children do not receive final diagnoses until they are much older, 